back to my channel and today I am Kenska and Stevie, here's my sister, and we're going to be opening another snack crate today. Now the weird thing about this quick is it's a lot more thin than the other snack crates, so I just I guess it'll be different. Let's open it. Oh Sweden. Ooh, hold on. Get the, the thing out. Sweden. Nice. Well, it looks like a young box kind of pattern. On the back. Oh yeah, like the young boxes that we used to do. Yep. Ooh, these look nice. All right, Ooh. let's just go ahead and get into this. I'm excited for the pink one. First off is Grill Estrella. They look um, like potato chips. That's basically it. Exciting. Oh, it says spring. I don't know that language, but I mean. Oh. That's our first. <coughs> That's our first thing that looks like potato chips. Oh. Tastes like an onion ring, yeah. but like salty, because I know it has like that oniony taste. I personally don't like onions, but I know what they taste like because I have technically had them before. But otherwise, from that, they taste just like a normal potato chip. I think that's really good. All right. We'll just like do a thing under it. So sad. Do the surprise under it. Thing under it? Yeah. Uh, oh, it's pink. Oh. They're called scally scum. Cool. Oh. Ooh. Don't forget, you can check your paper. And oh yes. What they are. Yeah, let's do that actually. The uh, chips were. Oh, let me see your hands cold. Uh, oh, salt and onion powder. Knew it. Are made from only the finest potatoes. Okay. So the pink thing. Bub Scally. Chewy skull shaped gummies that have the delicious tangy flavor of fresh picked raspberries. Have one or have them all. I'll probably have them all. Unusual. Oh, they are like kind of skull shaped. I don't know if you can see it. They're kind of like faded. Look like, like little like... Pac Man ghosts. <laughs> yeah, that or they kind of look like in the shape of Among Us characters. Mm hmm. They're really sour. Mmm. But get really sweet. I like that. Oh, he's kind of like bubble gum, but like raspberry flavor. And it's like sour when you first bite into it, but then it gets like sweet after. It tastes like delicious bubble gum medicine. Not the bad stuff, but good stuff. Mmm. That was really good. That's well. Eight I out of ten. I one at all. Eight out of ten. Give it a six out of ten. Ooh. Not meaning to like be low. Those are decent. So you can go I probably will it's have palisir. It appears to be like lemons because I see like a lot of lemons everywhere. Hold on, let's quickly read it. Sago so Apelicin, a zesty natural flavored orange soda. This refreshing drink has been around for decades, proving its ver its vast popularity. Can I open it for you? Um. Uh, let, let Ken's open it. Yeah, since we gotta use like a spoon for this. Oh. Pop open. Use your fingers from there on out. That's good. There you oh. go. That always like scares me because I never really drink stuff out of a can. Oh! Definitely zesty! Wow! It tastes like. I don't know if this has ever happened to anybody, but like if you bite into an orange and you get like some of the rind, kind of tastes like that, but also mixed with like the sweet of the orange. Ooh, it like stings your mouth for a second. I really like that. It tastes like orange juice, but like really fizzy, like a pop. I like that as well. Let's put that to the side. And dill and grass log. 
Oh, that sounds delicious. <laughs> okay. This is bringing me memories of the moss flavored Kit Kat that I got from Japan. Something like that. Moss and like grass. Oh, which I think was what they were going for, but I don't know. Oh! I said they looked like the sa the oh the onion like stuff, but they don't smell like it. Oh, they have like grass on them. I think it's probably the dill. Dill kind of looks like mm. little grassy stuff. Actually, that's really good. I was very scared when I saw the grass, but that's well, actually not bad. It just tastes like what? Oh, oh, we'll eat the rest of these later. Show me the package oh. again. Turn around. I thought. Oh. Yeah, I think it's just, um, that's just whatever it is in a different language. Oh. I don't think it's like grass. Okay, I mean like I saw plants and that supported my answer, but. I don't know, any of our peeps that have ever been to Sweden, a little insight would be good. Any grass, any grass? Leave it in the comments, but. That was very good. It was a nice dill flavored chip. Okay. Stop that over there. Oh, I see tons of chocolates down there. But getting in the candy food. Bill R. What are these? I have no idea. Hold on. Let's go look it up. That's the nice thing about this. Algren's Bill R. Al I'm sorry. I'm butchering that. Accidentally created in 1953, during an attempt to produce marshmallows, these light and chewy candies are molded into the shape of little cars. Mmm. So they're like marshmallows, light and chewy candy. Yep. That's what we got. I got white. Oh. They look like oh, they do look like cars. They have like little, oh, yeah. little tires. Mmm. Mm. Do they taste like marshmallow mm. or not? They quite? have like kind of the texture of them, but they're more chewy. And they're like kind of fruity flavor. And they're definitely very light and chewy. Those are very nice. Little fruit flavored. Chewy marshmallow things. Staying in the candy mood. So it's like candy. Nougat. Haven't we heard a name kind of like that before? Sure. Nougat. Nougat. Light and soft nougat is combined with a layer of dark hazelnut nougat to create a decadent chocolatey snack. I have no idea what nougat is, but... Nougat Sorry. is in like a lot of candy bars that we have in the States. Oh, well this one is like, wow. Oh. Description, I would say is on point. It's got the layers. Mm-hmm. See what it looks like inside. Oh. Oh. Try that, miss. It's like a just normal like chocolatey... Stuff Ooh, inside. it's all chocolatey. Uh huh. Mmm. 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 Tastes like Nutella and like. Like either a hardened mm. caramel or like something like that. That's different. I can't describe that very easily. But that is really good. Again, staying in the. Uh, the name Plop. <laughs> oh my. Plop. plop. <laughs> it kind of sounds what like is this? Pop. A plop with two P's at the end. A milk chocolate candy bar filled with decadent caramel. Decadent. Okay, decadent oh. caramel. I'm sorry. Each bar is cut into little squares perfect for sharing with a friend. Or not. <laughs> or not. Maybe. Or something. Depends who you're eating it with, or if you're eating it with anybody. <laughs> Maybe you live alone and you're just like, hey, oh. I saw this at the store and wanted to try it. There you go. Oh, oh, it's already creaming out. Look at that. 
inside. Mm. Is your mind blown? Chocolate with sweet toffee filling, yes. Tastes like um it has like the the texture of a um Cadbury cream egg. But the caramel is like the caramel you would get in the Milky Way. And then the milk chocolate is like the like a Hershey's milk chocolate. It's like a bunch of candies like mixed together. I'd say my favorite so far. Well. <laughs> the name was deceiving. The name was deceiving. Like, oh my gosh, those are so, those are, those have to be my favorite. Macy, how are those car, car candies? <laughs> Little marshmallow <laughs> car candies. Ooh, another one by uh, Marabou. The same one was uh, with uh, the Nougat. Also made by Mar Marabou. It's Oreos, like, covered in chocolate or something like that. Let me read it here. Okay. Um, ne Marabou Oreo. Delicious Marabou chocolate filled with, a, filled with a satisfying amount of Oreo cookie bits. Surrounded by sweet vanilla cream. Ugh, I'm dead. This, this sounds delicious. Tell this one's at least easy to tear. Sorry, sister, it's not today. Ooh, cookies and cream. Then I'll break this half in half. Macy, eat that. Mmm. Mmm. Okay. Mm. Which right? Tastes like um Oreo. What's it called? Like it's a uh, the kind of ice cream that has like Oreo in it. Like a McFlurry. Yeah, kind thing. of like that, like an Oreo McFlurry. But like it's more solid. Uh, cookies and cream. That's what I'm thinking of. Mm -hmm. Like cookies and cream, just with milk chocolate, and it does have vanilla in it. I can taste it. That is also good. So like. Dang, Sweden doing it right. Yes, Sweden's Here. like bang, bang, bang. If Delicious. you don't like that, how is it? Macy, I'm eating it after the video. Kex, it, I'm That's assuming right. it's like a wafer from the way that they did this letter, this lettering. But to be sure, Cloetta Kex bar. This crispy, this crisp, classic crispy wafer bar is covered in milk chocolate, leaving you with a perfect combination of sweet crunch in every bite. Next, let's try this. Oh, look at that. All right, I'm gonna get my scissors. Boom. Oh, oh, check that out. Nice. Oh gosh, it got all over me. Ooh. Mmm. Let's try that, miss. A normal, uh, it tastes like a vanilla wafer, but it has like a Kit Kat wafer, wafer texture with like that same flavor of like Hershey's milk chocolate on top. These are all just so good. Thank goodness that this was here for us. And because I'm dying, these are so guys. So good. Oh, there's like two of these in a row. Uh, each but of they both seem to be the exact same thing. Yeah, these are the same thing. Banana skids, banana and toffee flavored chew bar. So let's see here. Banana skid, a chewy, stretchy taffy with a unique taste of banana and toffee in every bite. Oh my god, not toffee. 
What? What's wrong with toffee? That stuff's delicious to me. Oh my god. Some people don't like toffee though. And I'm okay with that. What is up with all that chocolate? Just means more toffee for me, you know what I mean? Oh, What's up go. with all the chocolate oh. today? I thought it was this color, but then I turned it over and it was yellow. Alright, let me see. Um, we can't really like break this, just like cut it through scissors. Oh yeah. It's really stretchy though. Not right oh. there. Even the scissors can't get through it. Oh my god. <laughs> Hold on. Macy, you just bite a little bit of it. Mm. Oh, it tastes so good. Just like a banana Laffy Taffy. Exactly what that is. Oh! But it does have like a sweet flavor to it. That's good. I like these a lot. I've enjoyed everything. Oh, but there's more. Oh, wait. A dame, there's two of these as well. Nice, more chocolate for me. Dame. So, I actually don't know what to expect of these. Maybe you should just try it. That's true. It's uh, really quick of it. A almond caramel featured, features almond caramel covered in rich milk chocolate. That's all. Oh wait, the end says, oh, hot damn. Okay, there we go. Nice. Oh. Looks nice. Rip. There you go. I eat all the big pieces. Mm. Mm. It does taste like an almond. Covered in milk chocolate, but it's like a hard bar. Oh, hot name! Oh, as it says right there. Double snacks. <laughs> like it's saying double snacks. Double, double snack, snacks. A delicious combination of foam caramel mixed with crisp rice, then coated in milk chocolate. Peppies. I don't think we've really got one with oh, rice in it anymore. Oh, looks bubbly. Ah, oh. Oh. I like that. I like that a lot. Sweet caramel. Did you eat that? Ah, ah. It's like a sweet caramel. Just with like that chocolatey coating. <coughs> you okay? It's like the chocolate you would find on it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think it was all Oh my zesty. gosh. Let's get in all that <laughs> zesty orange soda, which will now be removing <laughs> from your touch. <laughs> Anyways, so it's like caramel covered in like Snicker Bars chocolate. That's also very good. And actually, is that our last one? That is. Oh All right, gosh. what's your what's your favorite out of this debris pile? I would say I my favorite thing from Sweden is. I think I'm gonna have to stick with these. The uh. Wait, what are they called? It was a funny name. Plop. Plop with two peas at the end. Gotta, gotta love it. My so favorite. Sweet. What's your favorite? This, this, and this. Well, obviously that, you burped because of it. It's like <laughs> all over the drink. <laughs> Anyways, guys.
leave a comment, subscribe, uh, leave a like, and follow me. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video because me and Macy really did from good old Sweden. Anyways, I really enjoyed this snackery and I hope you guys did too. Bye!